Hello everyone. Hopefully this stream will be a little bit better than the last one. I uh, I adjusted a lot of settings. Um, as well as I also rebranded rebranded re myself. Um, for most of my, my other channels except for Twitch because I still have to wait a month for that. But once I actually fix everything, that should be all right. Um, so now currently I am now branded Cappy Addicted Gaming or Cappy Addiction Gaming um I thought this one would be a little bit more suitable um in general I just thought this would be a little bit better more fits my personality as well as also uh makes it a little bit easier for certain people to spell I think some people just didn't know how to spell caffeine, which is kind of funny. <laughs> so, um, instead, I am now Cappy Addiction to Gaming. Uh, I changed mostly everything. I still have to do a few things, as well as I also want to do a few other things on my Discord um, and my stream itself. Once I actually like fully finish everything, that would be set. Uh, additionally, uh, I've been applying to other jobs and getting things set. Uh, I might have to change my stream schedule or it might be unaffected depending on what I actually go for. Uh, but we'll figure it out. Um, I'll keep everybody in the loop as much as I can. Besides that, we're going to be out here playing some Realms of Magic. I have played five to six hours of this game so far. It's, uh, it's pretty funny, I would say. <laughs> but we're going to get in here real soon and uh, show everybody what it's like. All right. Let's see it. And there we go. So yeah, I played about five to six hours of this game so far. That's why it's saying that. Don't I, I know a decent amount. I don't know everything. Uh, but we're going to start a new game. Uh, I think we're going to do something funny. Let's do a goblin playthrough. Yeah, let's do Goblin. Allows me to perform one additional jump. Stamina increased by 30%. Damage dealt increased by 25%. Damage taken increased by 25%. And Greedy, which uh, trading experience gained increased by 200%. So let's, uh, let's see this. Oh, this is the female. Okay, makes sense. Look at that face. My god. Give him some uh some ears real quick. I don't even think he's looking the same way with these eyes. Look at that smile. <laughs> That's a uh, that's something I'd definitely uh, have on my face if I looked like that. Let's be blue. Hmm. Now what should his name be? Let's uh... Let's name him... Name him Doopy. There we go. 
No tutorials. Yes, I'll skip it. I'm the hero. I'm the protagonist of this story. Oh god, I forgot how slow this game was. Alright. Now, what I need is a shovel. Do I start with one? I think so. I'm trying to remember all the controls here. Oh yeah. So this is a world map. Got a bunch of like small like dungeon zones to go to. As well as when we start progressing the story, it gets a little bit crazy. Let's see, there we go. So that's my weapon. That's my tools. So I bring out my torch. Can I uh can I loot? Give me that. I'm breaking in through your house, stealing everything you own. That's how I do it. Okay, so that's how I cook there. So this game has, like, everything. It has mining, cooking, you can make bases, you can do everything like that. It's pretty cool. I like it. My character definitely looks like he would probably break into somebody's house and start stealing everything. Give me that. That. I need as much money as I can get. Not because it's useful, just because I want it. So this is the building bench. Here's the blacksmith. There's the village idiot. Oh, give me the apples. That's what I need. Oh. Where is... It's the main captain right there. I got a book. I don't... Oh. My game just froze. What'd I do? Oh, auto-saving. Okay. That's, uh, that's good to know that, uh, your autosave will just freeze the game. <laughs> I wish I could just pull this chain and just, like, remove the floor underneath him. I think that's kind of a psycho thing to say, actually. Got no stam. So if I remember correctly, for each one of these maps, there's like a chest scattered onto like buildings and such, or like in the ground. 
So each area, when you go through it, you'll like find a bunch of different chests hiding around. And you can just like dig out the floor and such. Um, but I think we're gonna go see the miner that's down here. He has the uh, stuff we need, really. You see him in trouble. It's hard to work when there's rats in your cave. Uh, don't clip that. Okay, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go help him beat up rats. Well, actually not help him. He kind of just told me, like, I ain't going down there. So, if we do that, we can do that. But, we want to go back up here and talk to this guy. First. I'm looking for work. He needs axes. I'll get them for him. Uh, I forget how many, actually. This is where I can trade with him. He has a bunch of cool little knickknacks and such. Uh, I'm not sure what type of build I would go for, but should be uh, something kind of fun. Uh, each time you do something, you get a little bit of experience, as well as you also gain, uh, kind of like a level system, but the level system is a little off versus other ones. So he needs a tin axe, right? How do I, how do I check my things again? I'm trying to remember. Quests. Journal. You want 18 for the miner. But I need to destroy all the rats. Okay. This is going to be my first combat situation. There's no fall damage in the game. At least from what I've seen. There he is. Now. There's a wide range of perks. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure exactly what I want to do. We could do fire. We can use unholy magic. Nature. Ice. Um. Last time I played, I was just using fire. Um, because it was just super, super good. I think they nerfed it with the last update. So... We might do it again? Because there's, there's more perks now. Like, it goes further down. Uh... We're going to be a quick, agile fire mage, I think. Uh, but we need to kill them first. No. Oh, yeah. Here it is. Here, the professions trait. This tells you everything that you like. Underlining is like what you're leveling to as well as what you can do. Each time you level up, you get access to new stuff. Pretty straightforward and simple. No, combat in the game, I'm trying to remember exactly how you play. Because I have not played the game in a long time. There we go. Just gonna, just gonna, just gonna beat them like that. Because they are, I'm not sure what they're doing. They're, <laughs> they're not even hitting me. Uh... 
Okay. So each time you kill an enemy, as you can see, you can see that the XP has leveled up to 16. Once you level up is when you acquire your traits and perks, but you have to do it a certain way because like you're, it's like not limited to how high you are, but like what's happening. Uh, I'm just cheesing the AI apparently. <laughs> they, they can't just go here for some reason. <laughs> that switch it back let me through there we go found a secret I think there's seven secrets in total on this map. I could be wrong, but from what I remember there was. Gotta ha harvest basically all of this. Man, if I could swing a pickaxe like that, that fast, holding it with one hand. You think this guy, like, goes to the gym often? got all that we're gonna need some coal got another secret there's a limited range of where you can actually like smack or grab uh, but sometimes it, you can just kind of grab stuff through the wall Okay, so I need a copper pickaxe, copper shovel. But this guy also needs 17. Okay. Smell all of them. I don't know why I did it like that. But yeah, this game's pretty fun. I enjoy it. I, uh, I played when it was in beta most of the time. So some things are a little bit different and things are a little bit easier from what I can see. Three axes. Do I need more sticks? I might need more sticks. Uh, I'm trying to remember this guy, right? No. 
need the guy who actually I need to uh, get sticks from. Wait a minute. I think I remember how to get through this. Yep. Let's go. Do you imagine just coming home one day and in your basement there's just like a mine shaft? Some like goblin just ran in and started digging through it. Take all. Got some jester boots. I think the guy we're looking for is actually on the other side. I don't really want to waste any potions because they're like supposed to be used for emergencies. But it is quite a far run. Man, why does he keep? I swear, it never used to actually freeze while saving. I guess maybe that was like one of their major updates. Now this guy. Where's the wood that he provides? Here's a chest. I'm gonna grab that. Let me just yank it through the wall. <laughs> So, what do I got? Copper pickaxe, copper shovel. Promise to pay me for 25. I mean, I could just go to the next zone, grab it, and then run back. Pretty sure the next zone actually has forests. But... I don't know. Let me just do that real quick, actually. Because I need the experience and the wood. Give me that. So, for now, I'll invest in fire magic. Switch. That. Oh, there's a... The bandit. Um... I'm not sure what he's doing. All right. Fair enough, I guess. What do I have in my inventory? I should probably put stuff on. Need that. Bunch of scrolls I needed. <laughs> sort 
this. Hmm. I just realized I had two silver bars. So I need to keep those in my inventory because I need to sell them. Well, give them for a quest. Cut down this tree. How much I got right now in wood? Nine, I need a little bit more. Seems like there's a bunch of fancy stuff down there. I might go down there. Never been over here. Could do that. Wolf. Burn. And it's saved. <laughs> Oh, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Ow. Use everything to your advantage. Apples, farming increased, okay. Burn. Chickens. I need to get down there. I feel like I'm passing the way. Gotta take a potion real quick. Ugh. Almost level two. All three, actually, not level two. I feel like I am not going the right way, but hopefully I am. Why does it go for miles? You know that. Oh. I am looking for a nice place to live. Imagine just chilling out in the forest and saying that to some random goblin that just runs up on you with an axe in hand. Of course. There we go. Constant management of stamina and magic. <laughs> the 
Didn't I just see you? You know what? Can I just dig down? I'm about to pull a Minecraft moment. Either that or I'm about to run into a boss and die. Can I harvest this? Nope, it just destroys it. Okay. That's a cobalt. They're really fast, but really weak. Your health has like a natural slow regen. So I'm trying to make sure I don't spend any major potions. But since I'm low level, I need to. Especially since I have no good equipment. <laughs> He is. No, it saved while I was in midair. <laughs> I figured out the power of bullying. There we go. gone like the wind what's this I don't know or these guys no oh, he gave me a dagger that's what I really need let me uh that I'll supply this that increases my attack speed Equipped it. I wanted minus mana cost. Okay. Great. I'm just a lone goblin living my best life. Oh, he actually got over that. I didn't think he, I thought he was gonna get stuck. Much easier. Okay. I swear, I'm just gonna run into a boss and just instantly die. It's not like Terraria where you can just kind of move your screen around to like check every direction. Alright. Going deeper.
this way. Because I feel a little bit more safer going this way than the other way. Rats over there. Don't scare me. Uh, that kind of scares me, though. attack or anything. Why can't I do anything? There we go. I don't even know how I would be able to pronounce that. <laughs> That really hurts. Okay. Alright. He's dead. I wish I could take his spear. I feel like I've definitely not in the good zone. <laughs> okay. More enemies over there. I'm looking for more like secrets. Oh, my character is hungry. I got apples. Oh wait, actually I have cooked chicken. I think I just accidentally ate both at the same time. Whoops. Well, can't do anything about that. Definitely a Minecraft moment. I like this game because it's nice, chill, and peaceful. Uh, even when you're fighting enemies, it's not like uh, Skyrim combat music. It's kind of just the same. <laughs> him anyway, never mind. Okay. Well, there's nothing on this side. Something below me. I guess we just keep going deeper until, uh, Either I run to my death or I reach the end. I 
this point, I'm starting to think it's the ladder. Going straight for my death. There's another one. Uh. Luckily, rats can't jump. Oh, that's two of them. Get cheesed. I can't actually swing downwards. Well. Come here often. Oh, and it's saved. Nice. All right. All this for some wood. like those guys I don't like that there's more than here there oh there's a chest all right Can this guy jump up here And then I can just run back and jump back up here and they can't hit me. <laughs> just cheesing the AI. Doop. <laughs> what you gonna do? Can't hit me. Stab him to death. There we go. We got a scroll of smelting. Perfect. Probably other chests below as well. I feel like the deeper I'm going to get, the more likely a boss is going to show up. how I do it no way for anybody to fight back just cheese all right see this is why I can't play any sort of D&D &D game because I just end up doing something like this Straight up goblin core. I 
Imagine creating like a dungeon only for a guy to sit on top of a ledge and burn one of your most powerful creatures slowly. Passed so many like things above me as well as below me that I don't even know where I'm going at this point. I'm just digging down. <laughs> I'm eventually gonna reach the like the bedrock. Either that or like the terraria version of like their end, where it's just kinda like hellstone. Or meteor, right? going down let me just kill these guys real quick all I have to do is just burn them through a small opening oh I broke the opening all right <laughs> okay. Is this loud enough for you guys? I hope so. I spent so long trying to edit the audio. So, oh, wait, can't forget this. Oh, I didn't even see this. Yes, I'm greedy. Also, I'm a goblin, so I can't be greedy. I should rename my character as... Uh, wait, what's my name again? Doopy? Yeah, Doopy the... the <laughs> Doopy the Cave Dweller. He just stays in a cave 90% of the time. My inventory? I have 110 ore. Uh, I could throw these mud blocks out. Uh, I forget how to drop them. I should probably leave this cave before I get too engrossed in mining. Again, this happens to me in Minecraft. I'll just be creating a strip mine for like 15 hours straight and then I'll forget where I am. Alright. 
I don't remember if I can teleport outside of the cave like this. Let's find out. I think I can. I can, we're good. So I got a, a shit ton of material. Um, I have a scroll of smelting. So that increases that. Can I sell all this random stuff I picked up? I don't know what type of crafting there is when it comes to monster materials. Oh, actually, I need that. I can hand that. I can cook that. Oh, wow. I'm gonna keep those. Uh, you don't care about pine cones? Oh yeah, I forgot that existed. I'm gonna use that. Here's some dirt. <laughs> and some sand. There we go. And that's how the trading works, really. It's really simple. I like this game because it is very simple, you know? Bake a bunch of apples. There we go. Already level three in cooking. Now, all. Now, you need two tin axes, right? I keep forgetting my own quest. That guy needs a copper pickaxe and a copper shovel. Which I can get him. And this guy... He needs some sticks. And this guy needs three tin axes. Okay. So I'll make those, get those set. There we go. And then he just wants me to deliver those. When do you have the trade? Copper and pin and tin stuff. Uh, go down here. Do I even have enough copper for that? I think I do. Yes, I have seven. Oh, but I can't make anything copper yet. <laughs> well. Can I do this? I actually don't have enough coal for everything. We're doing it, guys. Level nine. So 
So I gotta talk to this captain guy up here. And then it is gonna force me into another quest, like usual. And then he gives me a tin dagger. Which is better. Do I have... I mean, I could do it, because I think I have all stone right now. Yeah. But, what do I have in my inventory? Those two items, tin. So, I just need uh, everything but a pickaxe. And, of course, it's got to save when I'm doing this. Of course, of course. Alright, there we go. There we go. Now, I could Skyrim it and make 16 daggers. <laughs> They're just one each. I think I will. Oh, actually. There's a first crafting bonus. Okay. I didn't realize that was a thing. I need more six again. Um, then I can get those tools, and I can trade some all the things that I don't want. I think I'll keep the sword just in case, but he can have that. This. Need that. And I'm switching as I go, like down the list. Okay. Don't need that. Have those. And then I could trade. I mean, I think I will trade, actually. Is there anything that I can get that improves magical damage that he has? I see stuff that increases health regen, which would be pretty good. I don't see anything that would, unfortunately. Why are copper bars so expensive, my god? And then I can buy another copper pickaxe from him. Just to get through stuff quicker. Um, I also do have 20 silver, so I could just do that. probably some other items that I don't need these
Don't need rock. That. Or stone. Oh, I already put that there. Did I already have a tin dagger? Oh yeah, I did. And I made another one. Alright. Okay. So, I'm only paying like $2. And I leveled up again, but I also want to use this. the essence to create a scroll of knowledge okay so I mean that would be really good what about this side that would all be better actually we're gonna get that one I'm gonna go give this guy his stuff All the ore. Okay. All of his quests are complete for me now. This is basically like a tutorial area to get you like started. Um Hindwood. Uh and I still have copper and tin ore that I can use. Actually, I probably should sort my inventory real quick. Uh, Minotaur battle axe. I'm, do I give it to this guy? me when I'm only half reading everything. <laughs> Got a little bit more XP. Alright, let's go probably explore. Probably this one. There. So this is like the continuation areas. So I'll just be like running in, getting more items. Running into new enemies and such. thing scroll farming okay not sure why you had that it's only doing two damage when he has a shield up oh I never died in this game before well <laughs> Uh, l let's go back real quick. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. They seem to have, like, a longer range now. Yeah, okay. So they have a longer range now where they can actually hit you when you're like standing behind them. Okay. So I'll have to be more careful now. 
Oh, I say that and immediately get hit. And I can't attack again. Okay. They seem to have randomized loot now. I just got another item. Yeah. Okay. That's kind of interesting that each of their item is kind of like slightly randomized. that one damage to this guy shield is too strong just get up here go on buddy get up here That guy does 28 damage per hit. I gotta be careful. He has a lot of fire resistance for some reason. He's so strong. Why is he not hitting me? Ooh, that hurt. Okay. You can stay down there for a little bit. Ouch. nothing on him anyway food set down here You hid while your friends were slaughtered. Oh. Ow. <laughs> All right. running all right he did okay I gotta be really careful of those things those are like one shot if I remember correctly unless they changed it which I don't think they did give me that What is this one? A 
so this one is increased physical damage. But this one has more armor. I think I'll go light armor. So, that one. No. It's up here. There we go. I found another shield. Oh, that one, that was really close. Let's see this one. Oh, okay. That one's just a straight upgrade. No, I guess it's all done here. So I found two secrets. So there's one more. Up there. How am I supposed to get up there? Can I build here? Oh wait, I sold all my building stuff, didn't I? Oh no. Can I dig this? I can't even cut a tree here. I doubt I could actually build. Do I need something like that gives me increased jump? I definitely can't reach that. I wonder if I can, like, sprint jump up there. From, like, this angle, maybe? No. What? I'm well fed, but I need more food. Okay. He's just eating it automatically. Okay. Well, can't reach that. I accidentally went to the wrong place. Oh no. Bandits attack this place? Yeah, I know. Go back. Let him know. My God. The trek. Drink some water. Everyone died. Yep, kill the traitors. Uh, this one? Yes. Windy Hills. Can I cut the trees here? Oh, damn. 
So I'm mad for two seconds. Oh, is that a fire damage increase? Let's go. More permanent fire damage. I thought it was frozen, but I just realized I'm stuck. So dumb. Get lost. Let me up. So basically, the captain is ruthless. Tell me more. So the, I actually didn't know this because in the original one there wasn't like a peaceful option but this one actually gives you like a peaceful option you can select now um so I'm not sure which one to do now <laughs> they didn't like finish the whole story originally so um because I played it during the beta so now it's just like oh well actually he he kills people and i'm like oh well damn let's do it now i don't have to kill them and i could steal all their items All right. It saved. I'm walking in. Now they have three, uh, and there's three hidden chests here, if I remember correctly. Yes. So I found one. Here's two. There's one more. Ow. Okay, they're not instant kill anymore. That's good to know. <laughs> if I just click randomly, I'll find it. Ah, there it is. All right, found all the secrets. So those are non-quest locations. All these ones have like uh, powerful enemies and such. So I'll probably go here. Yeah. To the rat pit. I'm gonna fight rats. Burn. Okay. 
Easy peasy. Okay. More health potions. Ow. Ow. Too low. <laughs> At least the early game enemies are really easy to fight. Is there a secret right here? There is. I think I need to go outside the cave and go down. Right? Maybe dig. I was already in the right area, never mind. Uh, I don't really know how I was able to grab that, but we're good. Fire resistant and the scroll of tanning. Oh, get the scroll of crafting as well. That's a lot. That's a maybe for equipment. Okay. Here's a dungeon. Door is blocked. I don't think the game engine likes that it auto saves, which is kind of weird to say. I got jester gloves. <laughs> got more pants. All right, you gotta be careful with this area. What is that? Things disgusting looking. It's like a mole rat. Wonder how strong it is though. It's really fast. Oh, Alright, it's pretty strong. That hurt. But can't really like I doesn't understand jumping. So I have the advantage. And I could just health potion if I need to. Nope. Get wrecked. This gives me more mana regen, but only frost. But it's really expensive, so I'm probably going to take it. Uh, what do I not want? Oh, I forgot to equip those. 
Um... Probably those. We need that. Which is that? That's only 72. I don't care about that then. Anything that's more than a silver, I'll take. Well, I slayed the powerful enemy already. Um. I'm incredibly strong. I'm so powerful. See here. Okay. Oh wait, is there anything there I can grab? Yes. Okay. Did I get all the secrets here? Yep. All right, that's everything. I'm heading back to town. Because I need to sell stuff. Hey you, buy my stuff. Why is that training sword so expensive? Really, like, it's only a little bit stronger than my dagger. <laughs> I'm going to keep that tin sphere for now. Um, don't need that. Don't need that. Is that everything I can really sell right now? I thought it would be more. I think I need a, a bag expansion, that's why. Let's see what you got. You do. Uh, I wonder if I can make my own before I actually buy one. Except. Wow, my training's already at level seven. Damn. Cook all those apples. Do that. Maybe this will actually be, help me be able to uh, craft a backpack like I need. But it's definitely giving me the XP I need. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. Need one more of those and one more of that. Need more of those fragments. Saving. Hmm. It doesn't look like I can yet. But 
I still can barely do anything else, too. I think I need to make, like, a small, like, home. Give myself enough materials to do so. And it should be able to really help me get to where I need to be. Is the tanning guy over here? Yes. Oh, it's already level five. Well, this is gonna, <laughs> this might make me level 10. I didn't think it was going to be that much experience to just tan a giant rat. This one's wolf pelt, so this one should give me a lot as well. There we go. So I need more levels in crafting, but I need more wood. Okay. Maybe I'll make place like here-ish? Let me do that. I'm gonna make a place like right there. As long as there's like trees and such and it's not like uh like a dangerous zone I'll build there. Seems like there's stuff underneath. But I definitely have enough wood to be able to do what I need to do. That's so many chickens, oh my god. The hell? How many chickens are here, guys? Four. What are they doing? wood do I have? 21 blocks of wood. Now, can I craft directly in my inventory? I don't think so. So I'll have to go back just to craft and then come back here. So I'm gonna get as much wood as I can get, so I can make that bench first. Oh yeah, I also need a hand in that wood, I should probably do that. So let me get more. I'm gonna build a huge house. No, I'm kidding. Um, it's probably going to be a small hovel.
Okay. How much wood do I have? 45. Let's head back real quick. It's so ominous when the music and like sound just immediately come cuts out. The drink. I need to turn in this. Turn this wood in real quick. You'll probably give me an ex enough XP to level up. Yep. All right. Higher than that, I can make one. That. And when I actually go over there and start building again, I could do that. Mark it with a little chest for storage. All right, time to start building our little house. We're going to build it like right here. probably do is throw all the raw food apple seeds stuff like that into there uh, I don't really need this on my person at 90% of the time those don't need potato seeds Eat those. This is food, so I'll keep that just in case. Put these in here because I don't have enough right now. And that's when I come back, I can just upgrade. Uh, I need more coal, which I'm going to need more wood for. I think I'm also going to need more wood in general. Uh, put those in there because I don't feel like reading them. Don't need these, that. 
Oh, and the pine cone. All right, so I can sell that shield actually when I get a chance. How much for a door? Well, I don't know because it's frozen again. There we go. He nails burlap cloth. cloth. Um. I don't really see a door unless I'm blind. Yeah, I don't really see one. Maybe I'm not enough level for it. So there's also an alchemy station. But I probably should make that stone furnace first. And expand the house. chickens. I like chickens. Floating house like usual. jump to do this one. <laughs> Minecrafting it. Should have known that was going to happen. back down this is just gonna be filled with benches <laughs>
throw all this back in here. Just gotta do it this way. Right. Sort. So I need more stone. Let me go harvest some of that. I'm gonna hide this chicken away. So they can't escape. Seal them in, in, uh, in a tomb. Okay, like that. Alright, so I need direct pine wood to be able to do that, or harvest it directly. Okay. So, I mean... The only thing I really need to do, technically, is be able to level up my uh, smithing. So then I can actually start making copper. And then eventually I can start making other things. But uh, for now, I'm going to head all the way over there and uh, slay someone else. He rolled over it. Thought I was about to get him, but he got me. More copper ore. Why is there so many trapped doors? Just like floating for no reason. Oh yeah, I forgot I could double jump. Alright. They're all below ground. Okay. <laughs> uh, he doesn't look fun to fight, actually. How am I supposed to get that one? I guess that way. No, open the door. Is a drink. Give me that. What is it? Scroll of wood cutting. Okay. Chest down there? I think that is. 
course it auto saves every time I do this. Still don't like have any armor. <laughs> Holiday book. Okay. Well, I got one more essence, so I need another life essence, and then I can upgrade myself. So, he'll probably give me that. Oh. What's that? Jester Slacks. Don't really need those. Those aren't as good. Alright, now at least. He's angry. Oh god, he throws he throws weapons. Well, that's one way to uh, prevent me from cheesing. Hmm. How do I want to approach this? Probably just directly. To be honest. I forgot to uh, do that. That hurts a lot. He does 24 damage. Yeah, this guy's gonna be a little bit harder than the other enemies. Jesus Christ. Okay. doesn't have as much HP, it's just he does a lot of damage. So as long as I can avoid his attacks, I should be okay. That's if I can avoid them. Ow. Does he heal? I think he heals. Ow. gonna charge him. I have 9 HP. It's gonna sit up here for a tiny bit. <laughs> I should just block his attack, shouldn't I? It saved. Oh god. There we go. When he drop spiked mace enforcer stuff, which is just a straight up upgrade, so I'll take that. Did I get everything? No, there's still two more secrets. Okay, good. Is there a secret below this secret? Got that one. That one, got that one. Has to be something on this side then. There's another. And then there's one more somewhere. I don't really 
know where it would be. Maybe... Did I? Yeah, I already grabbed that one. Maybe below? Oh, it actually gave me another backpack. Yeah, put that on. And I'll permanently increase my armor by 10. All right, there we go. Just got a new hat. Well, technically my first hat. Because I didn't have a hat before. So I just need to replace my actual like tunic area and then I should be able to uh to actually like fight a higher level enemy without being so scared. Um I can go to the next place, can I? I mean at this point, yeah. All right, and then I'll probably go turn in this quest afterwards. place looks a little more dangerous than the other places I've been to so far. There's definitely like secrets everywhere here. Oh, so secret entrance and exit. Something like right there. I can see it. Another. Oh yeah, I could have done that thing. I just remembered that. Eh, it's all right. Found a little hole. Letter there. Another chest. This place is really good for loot. Probably like a really strong enemy here. Oh, yeah. That's what I was expecting. Is that the boss? He's, he's like, glowing. He looks like he's got something around him. Ooh, 
Luckily, I was 31 damage. Ouch. Man, how are you that tanky? Alright. I can't fight this guy in a direct fight. <laughs> I will continue to do my cheese. showed that I jumped oh well I'm back here Double hit? Oh, there's a chest up there. Feel the flames of my vengeance. Why is he just... He's, he's, he's glitching out! <laughs> He doesn't know what's happening. Stab him. I did it. Why did that chest just have health potions? Finally got chest armor. It's all light armor. Always has been. many there's five here all right time to scour the map I thought I did see one that was like up here before like right there how do I get to that one I just dig straight from here yes okay Me adjust her hat. Scroll of trading. Level eight. Okay. Grab this guy. Time to find the rest of the secrets. Here's one. That one was uh, really simple to find, actually. Give me that. Is there another one right there? When I move, it looks like the chest door opens. It's a mimic. I think it's right there. Yeah. Oh, I need to go outside.
All right. My movement speed was permanently increased. Well, goddamn. Time to go turn this in. You don't look very well. I actually didn't mean to do this quest. Wanted to trade with him. <laughs> okay. Get that. Get rid of that. Don't need another. Long training sword. Well, I don't need this one then. Those are all quest items, okay. care about this weapon so I'm just gonna get rid of it I already have replacements for those not for that one the shovel um what are they selling didn't even look nothing really Nothing I can really see that I want. Okay. Take that money. Thirders. Oh, the apples regrow. I actually didn't know that. It's good to know. Okay. So, here. Forgotten Tomb. Let's check it out. Skeletons. Hey, hey, hey. Chill, chill. Top real quick or go inside. Nothing. Okay. So there should be three secrets here. So should be able to find them. Oh, 
I'm a better rogue than you. Well, that was close. I just jumped straight to it, which we didn't know was there. There's the powerful enemy. Can't hide up there. So those. What is this one? Just more monk gloves. Guard gloves. Scroll of crafting. Let me just go straight for him then. guy will hurt if he hits me. I already know it. Whoop. Oh yeah, he does. He hurts a lot. In fact, he almost one-shot me. Auto save. Auto save mid boss fight. He seems to only be able to do two attacks. Usually they're given a special attack, but he seems like he just has the same AI system as a normal guy. Probably because he's just really strong. Okay. And he can attack from behind. Alright, gotta be a little bit more careful then. <laughs> Burn him. up here no there is a lot of traps okay I definitely landed on it uh, well back to fighting him real quick <laughs> Good thing it saved mid-boss fight. I mean, I have 32 health potions, so I really don't have to worry about much. Okay. 
do not fall into the traps. Actually, I should probably just fall into the, like the this level right here, and then just run across and then jump. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, you take constant damage. It's not like it used to be. It's actually probably why the main reason I died. Okay. How many secrets am I missing? Two. No one was really easy to find. Bruh. <laughs> Man. The traps kill you more than the enemies do. Damn it, I tried brute forcing it. Alright, I can't do it like that. Alright, I'm just gonna fight him normally. Just do what I can. Then not run through all the traps. Oh, I actually got something different again. What's this? Uh, something I need. <laughs> All right. Debuffs, fire damage increase, it stacks about five times. That's what I need. What about this one? Nothing major. Alright, so where is these special areas? These secrets. already and I couldn't find any what about in the beginning doesn't look like it I'll check be like somewhere over here hmm saving Yeah, I don't see anything. 
Gotta be somewhere. Eh. I mean, I'm not really worried about it, so... I guess I'll head back. Go talk to the captain, then I'll probably upgrade myself. Oh, wait, what's this one? Oh, just another guard armor piece. I think that's all the quests that I have to do for him. Um. Okay. Completed part of that one. What's, what do I have left in my journal? So I have to go this way. Let me show me what you got. much for all your coal that's not bad because I have a bunch of stuff I can give you I'm gonna keep that just in case And then I can smell a bunch of tin ore. Um, do I need this? I don't think so. I didn't actually get to see how much damage it did. Do that. And then give me your top copper tools. The rest of them. Okay. So I don't have to waste the copper crafting them. But I probably will anyway. Just for the experience. Smelt the rest of these. Can now do copper. Nice.
level 11. Some people get confused because it says level 11 here, but you're technically like past that. All right. So, first time craft bonus. I need burlap rope and light fur leather. Get all those. Don't need any of them. Mm. Debating if I should sell that or not. Kind of middle with it. Um, I think that's everything. Yeah. Okay. There we go. There's the other side of the map. So as you progress, usually there's going to be another side of the map that opens up and that map you can explore afterwards. It is recommended for you to level yourself up before you do it because if you don't, you're kind of just getting destroyed half the time. Okay. Good. Talent earned. So I need that to actually get that, but I'm gonna get on this side. I can get another fire proficiency. Actually don't even have fireball yet. But that is a Fifty percent increase, but that dagger increase afterwards, I think, is going to be more useful. Yeah. So I'll get that for now. A bunch of cooked chicken. I'm gonna throw these in there. Throw that in there. Keep this one on me. Don't need those. Keep that on me these back in there and I think that's about it now here's the second village in the game Tell me something about this place. I don't read. <laughs> Stone as wood. Okay. 
to progress to each zone you have to i think speak to the head guy finish all the like minor things he gives you and then afterwards you just kind of go to the next zone each time um this guy's dead Oh. Oh no, it's a placeable container, never mind. There we go. Get some more. Why does he have so many? Is there... There is leather working and tailoring. Okay. Couldn't remember for some reason. Sir, let me, uh, let me. Thank you. Okay. I ain't got no potatoes. Secret chest. My first one of the zone. Saving. Flax. That's what I've been picking up. I don't even look what I pick up anymore. I just pick it up. quest that he wanted me to do was uh, five tin hatchets. I could probably make that. Alright, I can't trade with him for some reason. Said he saw something in the woods. Ow. Huh. Well, I don't see anything. I think you're lying. Can you imagine that's just like the natural order of things? If you don't see it, you just don't believe it. Do I talk to you? Nope. Okay.
Minecraft taught me anything, it means to always dig down. Never even listen to it. Just do it. Do I actually talk to them, though? That is the question. Did I get all of them? No, uh, there's two of them missing still. Eh, whatever. Um, these are all non-quest locations. That's a powerful enemy in there. Um, let's go there. Let's see what type of enemies we can run into. I didn't mean to take that mana potion. Rat! I think the fire's gone to their brain. There we go. So many rats in here. There's an undead rat that seems to apply poison when they bite you. Back off, Jack. Ooh, that hurts. Oh, they uh, they regain health if they get hurt. Okay, so I gotta be really careful. God damn it. It saved while I was doing that. Oh no. Whoop. What is he doing? They kind of like break though. Can I just like... 
I know what you're saying. You can place blocks, but I think it's because this is a quest area that I can't do it. Yeah. <laughs> I think the rat, though, is, uh, he's got a little bit of a, uh, no brain left. Oh, wait. Can I reach him here? Got him. Alright, where's my mana potion? There we go. <laughs> if you want a boss dead, you gotta kill him right. There we go. Let's see what I got. Wow, that's a really good weapon. It's a shame it's not a dagger. Well, <laughs> take all their skin. Oh, there we go. Secret chest. Definitely gonna put those on. I wish you could zoom in on this game. Like you can be I wish you could get like super super close. But I think they stopped working on it with the updates. I think they put out their 1.3 final update because they wanted to focus on another game. Why did my double jump not work? Oh wait, I can reach the wall. There we go. 